that's when we heard the shots. And she just started screaming. Neighbor Kathy Black is trying to make sense of what happened seconds after she heard those shots. A police officer had just killed her neighbor's 29-year-old son after responding to an argument between him and his mom. I spent all day yesterday trying to convince Elvira that the that the police would not shoot an unarmed man, and I was wrong. Phoenix police arrested Officer Richard Crisman, a nine-year veteran on the force, for aggravated assault after his partner revealed what he says happened. These are, these are issues of grave concern to the community. Court documents show the officer held a pistol to the suspect's head and said, quote, I don't need no warrant, followed by some profanities. Then, after tasing the suspect, using pepper spray, and shooting his dog to death, the report says the officer shot and killed the man, despite the fact he was unarmed and his partner did not believe there to be a threat to himself. His partner called it the worst day of his life. We're supporting our officer. We believe that our officer acted within the scope of what is authorized under law, under department policy, and at this point, we're standing behind him. The Phoenix Law Enforcement Association is speaking out for Officer Crisman tonight. They paid his bond and say officers have to make split-second life-and-death decisions every day. Let due process take place. Let due process run its course. In Phoenix, Jennifer Parks, ABC 15 News.